At Corteva, growing food starts from our hearts. Join us on a global tour as we show you the science and meet the passionate people growing our world. Welcome to the Heart of Science. Hi, I'm Praveen, and this is the Heart of Science. I'm a data scientist for Corteva AgriScience here in Hyderabad, India. Today we are at the Tupran Research Center. I'm going to show you some of the science that we do here. Come with me. When I was a child, I always wanted to be a scientist. I really became passionate about agro-science and uh, trying to understand the uh, different aspects of agriculture. India is a very uh, complex environment. Growing here is not very easy. Many of the time, technologies are not readily available. So one thing which I ask myself every day is, how do I actually transfer all these technologies and solutions and bring them closer to farmers? Data science is used in agriculture today in a number of ways. It could be about um, the field data, the genetics of the seed, from drones, satellite imaging, the sensors that we are installing in the field. This is actually the future as we speak, reimagining agriculture as we know. Thanks to uh, data science and machine learning, we can now track the flow of um, the pest. Knowing this is really powerful because it helps farmers to uh, take preventive measures at the right time. Because of this data, we can now share this knowledge with our farmers and we can help them choose the seed which is more appropriate for their needs and also follow better management practices that are sustainable for them in the long run. Here is an interesting project that I'd like to share with you today. It's called the PyBot. This particular technology, we are trying to make it more accessible and affordable to small landholding farmers here in India, which is very close to my heart. Meditation has contributed a lot to my personal growth. If I feel calm and if I feel peaceful, I feel that I can bring that also to my workplace. That calmness and peace helps me stay really focused. And I, I'm able to connect with myself and also I'm able to connect heart to heart with people. My kids while growing up, I'd love them to actually be in connection with the earth. How do we actually uh, make the future generation free from the effect of the climatic changes that we are currently going through? How can we make this earth a better place for them? This is very important. Keep growing.